Jordan has about 6,500 mosques. Most of them rely on traditional sources of power to keep the worshippers cool. And with people coming in and out all day to pray, mosques are one of the biggest consumers of electricity in the country. But in the last four years, about 1,000 of them have started running on solar power. As the government foots the bill for Jordan's many mosques, that could mean major savings for Oman. The electricity bill has declined in general, and the ministry has noticed this at mosques which run on solar energy. At some of these mosques, the bill was even down to zero. The Islamic Affairs Ministry and the Ministry of Energy fund about half of the costs of getting mosques to switch to solar energy. The rest comes from donations. If we receive enough funds, I think within two to three years, all mosques will switch to renewable energy. The ministry says it wants to include another 5,500 mosques in the scheme, but solar panels are expensive. And even with the promise of savings in the long term, it's been hard to get the project funded. And solar energy is about more than just being cost effective. We know that renewable energy doesn't produce gases that cause global warming and climate change. We have started to witness the repercussions of climate change in Jordan and in neighboring countries recently. It seems like it would take some time to get all the mosques in Jordan onto the solar grid, but the country seems to be on its way to a more environmentally friendly future. Francis Collings, TRT World.